with gear down and don't make it harder than it already is. Well, that's what she said. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel, Captain SQ, where we're going to discuss on Airbus systems, emergency procedures, and supplementary techniques on how to fly the plane. A320 ILS guide slope interception from above. What to do when it happens? Disclaimer, always refer to your company manuals, this video is merely a guide. Before we start, do smash the like button and subscribe if you like to see more of these videos. Okay, let's begin. Should ATC delay descend on the approach or cleared an aircraft late onto the ILS or slow actions by the crew, probably you are thinking about having ice cream, then a glide slow interception from above may need to be performed. The crew must react without delay to meet the stabilization criteria. What is the stabilization criteria? On the correct lateral and vertical flight path, the aircraft is at the desired landing configuration. The aircraft is at a target speed for approach with the thrust stabilized, usually above idle. And by 1000 feet above airfield elevation in IMC or 500 feet above airfield elevation in VMC or any other height defined by your operator policies and regulations. If the aircraft has not captured the glide slope by stabilization height, then a go around must be performed. What is the recommendation? Is if you are anticipating a glide slope capture from above, the aircraft should be at least be in configuration 2 with gear down and don't make it harder than it already is. Well, that's what she said. In order to get the best rate of descent and keep below limiting speeds, flats full would be preferable. When you are cleared to intercept ILS, press the approach button on the FCU and confirm lock and GS are on. When lock star is engaged, select the FCU altitude above aircraft altitude to avoid unwanted alt star capture. Select vert speed 1500 feet per minute initially. Use vert speed rather than open descent to ensure that the auto thrust is in speed mode and not idle mode. Monitor the airspeed to avoid exceeding VFE. Speed brakes may be used. When approaching the glide slope path, GS star will engage. Monitor the GS capture with raw data pitch vert speed and GS deviation. Once established, configure to landing configuration. And that's it for this video. Do smash the like button and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.